Garmin Descent dive computers are your buddies for exploring both of your worlds, underwater or topside. In this video, we'll go over how to set up and use your MK2 for a dive. Descent MK2 series supports six different dive modes. Select the dive mode that matches your dive. In this example, we'll select single gas. Once that is selected, you'll see the pre-dive check pages showing you how your descent is currently configured for that dive type. You can press the down key to change settings and access the full list of dive configuration options. Here you can edit your gases, water type, change conservatism, and update many other dive settings. The settings you select will stay set for that dive type, making repeat dives easy. You can also add a customizable dive page with the items you'd like to see. To start your dive, simply descend underwater. Note, your watch will mark your entry point as long as you have selected your dive type. Once underwater at a depth of at least 1.2 meters, the descent will automatically start tracking your dive. The main dive page will feature these data fields. You will see dive time, temperature, NDL time remaining, depth, and gas mix. Tissue loading can be seen on the gauge on the left of the screen. On the right is an ascent descent rate indicator. If your NDL runs to zero, it will be replaced with the next stop depth and stop time. Along the left, divers will see a graph showing the stops they need to complete. The display will be the same for your final safety stop at 3 meters. From the main page, you can press the down key or double tap the screen to view the dive compass. The compass indicates your directional heading. Your set heading shows in green on the compass tape with an upward pointing arrow. Your reciprocal heading will show in red on the compass tape with a downward pointing arrow. At the top, you'll see the degrees and direction to get you back on your set heading. Press the start key to reset the heading or to easily change to 90 degrees left or right or switch to the reciprocal heading. Press down to scroll past the compass and see a screen that shows additional information. Note, if you are using the MK2i, you will see the air integration screen first. Otherwise, the next screen includes current battery life, heart rate, and time of day. You'll see a heart rate graph on the left and a CNS graph on the right to indicate oxygen exposure. When you return to the surface, the descent will automatically stop the dive timer, find your GPS exit point, and save your dive. When the dive is saved, you'll see a screen with some key stats right from the wrist. You can automatically sync your dives with the Garmin Dive app. Here you can review it along with previous dives you've recorded. Thanks for watching. Watch the other videos in this series to learn more about the available dive modes and using your Descent dive computer.